We are doing a dosing problem. Let's take a moment to read the problem. Your client receiving steroids is on the very high dose sliding scale insulin coverage. His blood sugar is currently 399. How many units of insulin should you prepare to administer? This problem is different from most dosing problems because we are dosing insulin. Insulin has its own syringes, and the syringes are marked in units instead of milliliters. We'll notice that the problem itself asks how many units to administer. There is very little math to do because most of the time patients give themselves insulin at home. The last thing we want patients to have to do is to do a bunch of math conversions before they give themselves the needed medication. Syringes specifically for insulin have been created so that there is not math involved. So we want to look at all the details. We're to use the very high dose. So when I look at this low dose, medium, high, very high, I'm in this column. We have current blood sugar of 399. So I look at the glucose level, that's the blood sugar level, and I'm looking 399 would be in this range. So I follow over to the very high dose, and I see that I should give 25 units. So the answer to this question is 25 units. I don't do any math, I just carefully read the information.